today I'm going to be doing um, a video about like my hair I guess yeah that's what we're gonna do um my hair is a hot shitty mess right now so I need to hydrate and detangle cuz boy look at this guys it's like disgusting oh I don't even know if you guys can see me let me just move it probably here yeah oh it's better right there yeah oh my god this is like disgusting so what I'm gonna do I am going to wash my hair and then I'm gonna condition it like deep condition it and then I'm gonna put product in my hair so I usually what I usually do is I sleep with the product in my hair and then in the morning time I kind of like defluff and actually style it blah 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 so I was at Wegmans and I saw this so I said oh let me just pick it up really quick so it's the seaweed bath company and this is the Ari Argan shampoo and it's for normal to dry and damaged hair so that's what it looks like can you guys see it mm, I don't know the focus isn't that great but yeah that's what it looks like and it has the conditioner too so I'm gonna use both of these to wash my hair and then I'm gonna use this intense hydrating hair mask by Shea Moisture and this is the Hakuna Honey and Mafura Oil oh my god this thing smells so good mmm I don't have that much left look it's like empty almost but I'm gonna do my best to use this so yeah so I put this on for 10 minutes you know shave my legs do all that fun stuff and then yeah that's it so I'll see you guys soon okay so I washed my hair it's like dripping freaking wet. Ah! So yeah, I washed my hair. I'm like, yo, that Hakuna, like the deep conditioner, guys, if you have dry hair, you need to get that. Seriously, you need to get that. It is so good. Okay, so right now what I'm using is Turby Twist just to dry my hair. I didn't do my nails because it gets gets caught in my hair and it's horrible. Okay, so I just squeezed a little bit at the bottom because um, it's going to be dripping wet. I'm going to use two things. I'm going to use the Curl Enhancing Smoothie, which this is my holy grail. I love this thing. And then I'm going to use the Jelly Soft Curls. So, yeah. That's what I'm going to do right now. I usually just part my hair and get like a clip. I couldn't find a clip, so I'm going to use a scrunchie. <laughs> so I just put my hair in the scrunchie. Snoop is staring at me from the bed. He's such a weirdo. Okay. <laughs> you hear him crying? So then I just put that and then I take the smoothie. I take just, you know, normal size tomorrow. And I just lather it on, mainly to my ends, because my ends are like super dry. I need to get a trim again. So put that in there. Make sure it's nice and saturated with product. Okay, so that's that. Now that we've done that, I take the jelly. I take the jelly. And I just put some bloop, like a dollop, dollop, daisy, and then I just take it and just split my hair and put some over here. Oh my god, this jelly one smells so good. It smells like clean, like laundry. So yeah, so then we do that, right? And then I'll scrunch, scrunch, do that, scrunch. But no, seriously, I'm in a desperate need of a haircut. It's so bad. So yeah. So I scrunch, scrunch, scrunch. And I do this for my whole hair. Sometimes, like, I'll take pieces and, like, I'll, like, twist it. You know, just for fun. So I'll just twist, 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 twist. I got the bottom. Okay, done. Nice and saturated. Ugh. And make sure like your hair is like semi-damp. You don't want it dry. So if it's dry, you get a spray bottle. You get this at the dollar store, Target, anywhere. And just spray the area and then put the cream on with the um, 
gel um yeah with the gel because then what's gonna happen is your hair is gonna be really dry and it's not gonna be good and it's, and it's just gonna be frizzy it's gonna be all over the place but some people like frizzy I like frizzy on occasions but yeah I don't even feel like I need like the gel like I feel like with the curling smoothie I could just leave it in my hair and my hair will be popping but I just want some extra definition and moisture so I add the gel to it but honestly my hair I can do without without the gel And I don't know, for my hair goals, like for this year, I think I just want my hair to be like really long. But who doesn't want like long hair, right? But my hair, it's just, it will never, like it'll grow long, but when it dries, it's more like puff, which I'm fine with too. I like it, cause I feel like I look like a lion. But yeah, so those are my goals for my hair. I don't know how I'm gonna get there though. If you guys have any tips and tricks on how to grow hair, leave them down in the comments below. Okay, we're almost done. Oh, and guys, I don't wash my hair every time I like wash my hair. I do co-washes a lot, and I usually like, sh I mean, wash my hair. Ugh. That's not what I meant. I meant I don't shampoo my hair all the time. What I do is I co-wash, right? So I'll co-wash and then when I see there's like a lot of buildup in my hair, I'll use like clarifying shampoo to like wash my hair. But I love a good co-wash, honestly. I think that's like the best thing for anybody's curly hair. But you know what? Honestly, I'm just so lazy to wash my hair or sometimes they even do my hair like I am notorious for doing top buns all the time and it's so bad because at the end of the day I have like so many knots in my hair it's pretty disgusting so yeah I need to cut that you see guys like I feel like I don't even need the gel like the smoothie works so good but I like the gel So guys, I was looking um, on this artist's website. His name is Perlata Projects. Perlata Projects. Uh, he's from Washington Heights in New York. And he has some really dope, cool art pieces. I'm going to leave some things linked down below. I actually have, like, um, his shirts. I think, yeah, I have two of his shirts. So, yeah, they're really cool. Um, but no, so he has pins, right? So these pins... One of them is like a girl wearing like a little robe or whatever and it says slay in Spanish. So I'm like, oh my god, it's so cute, I need to get it. So when I looked, comes to find out it was the bad girl in Maria del Barrio. Yo, any Spanish subscribers, let me tell you, Maria del Barrio was my shit. It was so good and I think I was like young. I was like in grammar school watching this and I was hooked. It was so bad. It's so funny because when I was little, my mom used to punish me, like, taking away my favorite shows, and I hated it. I love WWF at the time, because now it's like WWE or whatever. I used to love wrestling. Like, that was my shit. I loved it. I used to watch it every Thursday, every Monday when it used to come on. Like, it was my jam. So then, when I used to get in trouble, my mom was like, no wrestling for you. Oh my god! I would go and cry, and I'd be so upset. And then I'd hear my dad, like, listening to the, um to like the show and I'll try to like listen really close and my mom be like, I hear you, go to bed. It's be so sad. But yeah, those are ways that me and my dad used to bond. And kind of still do bond, like we watch shows together and stuff, like movies, Jeopardy, Wheel of Fortune, all that stuff. But me and my dad and wrestling, bomb. So good.
Okay, so the front, usually it gets like really, really dry. I don't know, like the texture in the front of my hair is so different from the back. I know a lot of girls probably can relate. But yeah, so I spend a little bit more extra time on the front. I need to add some water. Let me just take this thing off of my hand. Um, yeah, my hair's getting dry right here. Yeah, so those are ways that me and my family bond watching shows. Okay, spray bottle. I need it. I'm gonna spray this right here. Okay, so usually what I do for the front, oh my god, I just take it and I curl it sometimes just to give it an extra definition because it is looking crazy sometimes crazy but yeah how are you guys doing you doing good this is like the worst part of like a curly girl's like day like wash days are the worst if you think wash days are the worst give this video a thumbs up because seriously, wash days are the worst. I'd rather go two weeks without washing my hair. Seriously, two weeks I would go. I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. All right. So I just did the front. So you see, I just did like these little curls right in the front. So when it dries in the morning, all I do is separate them. But you can like curl like the back too. like. If you want to get like curls at the bottom, just curl them like that. This is important too, an important step in the process. Ah, squish, squish, squish. Okay, this is the last part and we're going to be done. know how long this video is gonna be probably gonna have to edit some stuff out oh, it's done guys there's no more nah. I need to catch one of those sales that they be having Shea Moisture okay oh, beautiful I love it I love it guys I love it okay so we got that. <gasps> Seriously. Oh my god, it's so effing good. I love Shea Moisture. Like that one, the Curl Enhancing Smoothie. Bomb, man. It's bomb. <sighs> like, you don't even need this job. So now we do the flip. Okay, so you see guys? Oh my god, I love it. So then what I do, I'll show you guys. Don't try to try not to touch it too much. I touch it a lot because I'm like rebo. But yeah, so boom. Done with that part, right? One minute. Found it. So, what I do is I take the satin bonnet. Bonnet. The satin bon bonnet. Satin bonnet. I get the satin bonnet and I flip. Woo! And I took all my curls. Snoop. What are you doing? Okay, you see? So then I do that. And I sleep like this, guys. I don't know if I'm doing it right. I really don't care if I'm doing it right. No, I take that back. That sounds really mean. I do care. I do. But 
this is what I've been doing like for a long time and I had no issues my hair be flourishing so yeah so I just kind of like rock it a little bit like that and then I go to sleep so I'm gonna wrap this part up for now and then in the morning I'm gonna show you guys like what it looks like what I do to kind of fix it up and stuff like that so I'll see you in the a.m. okay guys good morning it's the next day so I'm gonna show you guys how I do my hair in the morning so I take off my bonnet and you see it's like 60% dry it's not even all the way dry I'm sorry I'm gonna look at the viewfinder real quick but yeah oh my god so good Snoop one minute poppy one minute so yeah you see like my hair is like super shiny it's so nice so He's just playing and he's like getting me on my nerves. Okay, so we're gonna get a pick. I have two picks that are my favorite. This one, which is like a metal pick, and I picked this up at Ricky's NYC. So, and then I got this one. I think I got this one at like um just like a normal beauty supply store. So I, I'll use this one first and I'll just You see guys? everywhere and I'll use this one and I'll just like pick under like that pick but you see look at the curls they're like super defined I love that curl enhancing smoothie don't touch your hair too much guys because you know So that is about it. Like I said, my hair is like 60% dry, so it's gonna get bigger. So, but I usually just don't touch it too much, but oh, it's so hard not to touch. Okay. But yeah, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like to have any more, like I guess, wash day videos or get ready with me curly edition I don't know we'll figure it out I guess we'll go through this journey together and yeah if you like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to comment down below and subscribe I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and I'll see you guys soon bye